We call this a scoreboard view. This is sort of your classic leaderboard. What we're seeing here is actually an ordered list of the individual bots and how well they're performing. So down the left-hand side, you can see basically that each of, the, uh, each of the bots has a color, and in the real game, those colors will be assigned to bots, and throughout all the visualizations, that same color will apply. There are scorecards in the arena view, and everything will all be colored correctly. They'll have some iconography in the little square sections that you can see here that are blank, each team having its own icon. Um, and additionally, we see the aggregate scores over here of each of those elements of the overall scoring that we were talking about, where we have availability, security, and evaluation, each being tallied in, the, in aggregate across all of the services, as well as the overall team score being represented by this bar graph, by this gray section of the bar graph, and the numerical score that's been calculated here. So, just as each of these elements are the aggregate score across many of the challenges all at once, this line graph represents the last several rounds uh, of that aggregate score. So we can see changes where a team is starting to pick up or where they're starting to have trouble or where they're not making too much progress at all. In this instance, this actually fairly clearly demonstrates another, uh, another thing that we've touched on a couple of times, but the, the importance of availability scores becomes very apparent because they're almost ordered according to their availability. There's a little bit of a delta here. And that's actually because all of these points that are being scored here in security and evaluation for one of these teams with a low availability score are actually not being able to be recognized in the computation of the final aggregate score. So we'll come back to this view very, very regularly to show leader changes. You could see uh, as, as this ran, you could actually see that once the scores were tallied, leader changes will be present on this board and it'll basically be your constant heads up display for which teams are in what position.